Hello, my name is Simon Bingham, and this is uh, my Junos video on the VGP feature AS Override. So, what does AS Override do? Well, AS Override helps cope with a uh, scenario where you have the same AS numbers in use in in different customer sites. So, say you might be a you might be a service provider, and you might be peering, with, and the customer might, for example, want to use the same AS number on every single site. Well, what will happen if you do that is that um, routers will sit, won't, won't, won't advertise that AS number back to the same AS, so you won't see the AS number used uh, repeatedly. So obviously, you know, the loop prevention mechanism stop that from happening. So here, I have my network here with AS, the same AS number here and here, so you can see that's not a mistake. Um, I have BGP peerings here, and so what we should see is we should see, and I'm up, I'm, re -up, I'm advertising the loopbacks into BGP. So all these loopbacks you can see here are advertised into BGP. So we should put up a look in the routing table and, and see if that's working. So um, what I'll do is I'll try and just sort of shrink that down. I'll try and keep the diagram in view if I can, because personally with these things I find it quite confusing when you can't see the diagram, but I'll do my best. So. Right, so if we jump on to say R29, which is this router here, which is this router here, and we just do a show route, and we can see some BGP routes work. So we can see 100.0.0.24 are base, basically the last, the, you know, the, 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 the 24 represents the, the router number. So 24's loopback is, is there. We can see that router 25's loopback. Is being advertised, and we can see it on here. So we'll look onto it. But um, the loop back from this one is conspicuously missing. So 14 is missing. So the configuration could not be a lot simpler. So if we jump on to our R25 here, and we go show. Let's do show what we've got here, and we do. Yes, override. Commit. Now, if we jump back onto our R29 on our remote system, so what we want to see is we want to see the dot 14 appear here. If we just do a show route. And what's happened here? What's happened here? So it's taken a few moments. So what it'll do is it'll torn down all the BGP re relationships here, and um, we'll see that it's slowly come back up. Okay, there we go. And straight away we can see that come up. Now what we can see here in the AS number is it's basically AS30 has, has added its own AS number again. So what it's done is it's taken the AS number that it's got from here, it's added itself again and then it's advertised it to here because you can see if you look here you can see 14 is 30 30. And that's about it, that's my video on AS override over.